guys. It's Christy Sanders, your independent Scentsy consultant, and my little sidekick, Jack. It's not so little anymore. We got a fun shipment today, and um, we want to show you what's inside. We haven't done many unboxings lately. Oh, and we have our little puppy show, Popper. I don't know if Popper shows. You know, Popper's got to get in all of our videos. Yeah. Oh, she's got her back turned. Okay, so Jack's going to help show um, show y'all what we got in our box today. This is our box. We got a box. Not a giant box, but we got a pretty good box today. And we've been watching the tracking on this one since we ordered it eight days ago. And so, um, Jack's pretty excited about it. Let's look inside. Yeah? Beans. So, I don't know what we should show y'all first. All right. First, let's let's show this because it's on top. We'll, we'll dig down until we get to the bottom. All right. So, we did get a wax, um, a six-bar um, uh, bundle and save collection of some waxes that we've been melting this summer um and obviously uh, apparently we love coconut at our house so we ordered reordered some things that we've been melting here lately we've got um my halo co coconut oh, and I, don't, I gotta learn the secret how to get those to to focus but my halo coconut is kind of a a florey it's got a floral scent to it and it's a little coconut coconutty but um after it's been melting about an hour, it's just you just smell the coconut. So we love that one. We got cocoa for coconuts, which is mostly just coconut. We got cocoa lemongrass, which is coconut and lemongrass. Mmm, it smells so good. This one is white, but when it melts, it melts clear as water. So um, don't melt it and forget and pick up your warmer because we had a little wax accident with uh, Sam thinking our warmer was empty and it had a coconut lemongrass in it. We, we got, yeah, yes, with our petals warmer over there. Oh, um, cocoa lime. This one is, oh, I love this one. We got it in my car and I've got it in the pods at my desk. You yeah, you smell that one. I don't know if you smell that in the house because we, I made samples with my last bar. Oh, and, yeah. and then we I got remember. two bars of the Berry Bright, which, um, has a, a lot of blueberry, raspberry in it. It smells very similar to the um, Aladdin's Three Wishes. If you're, if you have smelled that or remember it, the cocoa. I remember whenever we had this in the bathroom in a warmer. Yep, we had it. It smelled like in the lime Kool Aid. Yeah, it's a good one. But if you bundle and save, if you need refills on your waxes, if you bundle and save, you buy five, buy five, and you get one free. So I always order my waxes in sets of six that way we get one free just get the best deal you know we do have a set of pods in the toasted acorn and oak which is a fall scent but it was on our clearance page and mm, that smells good too sam loves the toasted acorn and oak pods in his uh, he's got an air purifier in his room and so he loved this is one of his favorites so i got him one more set of pods i may need to get him a few more before they discontinue them all right now you want to tell what we really want to talk about? Yes. Yes. Okay. The Mando scent pack. Oh, you're turning it around backwards, Jack. You just want to talk about the scent pack? No. Here's your hint. This is the Mandalorian's Air of Adventure scent pack. Okay. And the Air of Adventure... Um, you can almost smell it through the package... It has a, uh, we can go ahead and open it. It has a minty and a um, citrusy scent to it. So it's got silver mint in it, which is supposed to be symbolic of the Mandalorian's armor, right? What's his armor called? Baskar? Beskar. No. What? Beskar. See, I gotta get these facts straight. Beskar armor is supposed to be like very, like super valuable, right? Yes. Like very, Indestruct very valuable. Indestructible. Indestructible uh, armor. Okay. So, you want to smell it? You want to smell it, Piper? <laughs> so, um, the scent is uh, silver mint, and then it's got some bergamot, which is a citrusy fruit, kind of like orange, and um, and then it's got some orange in it, too. So, what do we need to put this in, Jack? Not Grogu. Nope. Or Whoa. this Grogu. Oh, yeah. Or this Grogu. Yeah, we had to get out our little buddy family here. All right, Jack, open him up and let's show our friends. If I don't knock the camera off, let's show our friends what's in there. Y'all, they've been waiting for this to come out. 
I don't know, since the beginning of, when did we find out about this? Pretty beginning of April, really maybe. So we're pretty excited. Yeah, don't tear the box. Yeah. Oh, we didn't even show the box. Nobody's interested in the box. Okay. Well, I'm interested in the box. Right. Well, you, if you're going to show it, show the front of it. That's what we're interested in. Yeah. Who is this, Jack? Introduce him and tell us about him. Mando. It's as simple as it gets. Jack. Mandalorian. He's the Mandalorian. The Mandalorian. If we have any Star Wars fans out there. Isn't he cute? All right, so his little floppy legs. He's got his armor on. He's got beefy arms and the beefy head and beefy uh, body right here. But then he's got noodle legs. Skinny <laughs> well, all legs. the Sensi Buddies have skinny legs. But we know he was really a muscular kind of hero, right? Show the back and let's see how what his little back looks like. He's got a jet pack. And he's got his cape. And the cape is draped over to one side because it was always draped over to one side in the show. Right, Jack? Uh, He only wore either the cape, which was normal, or he wore the jet pack with no cape. Oh, well, then I don't know. I thought it was to they the side in some of the that, videos. Just, uh, they probably... Well, Boba Fett did, did that. But Boba Fett did that. Okay. Yeah. So, how do we put this in? Show where, where's his little scent pack pocket. It's in his jet pack. <laughs> so, put his scent pack in there. Does he fly in the jet pack? With the jet pack in the show? Yes. Okay, see, I need to... The new season will come out when? This... Late this summer or fall? I don't think there's going to be another season. I thought there was going to be another season. We probably should look that up before we got on here. There is no Mando without no Goo Goo. Okay, so, so it's okay. So this is Mandalo Mando. We call him Mando, but he's the Mandalorian. Um, here's his little jet pack with the pocket that you can put the scent pack in. Oh, 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 oh. There's the scent pack. Hi, Leanna. Jack wanted to show off the Mandalorian. And, oh. But if you buy the Mandalorian, you get a free friend to go with him, right? Yes. So, show the free friend. So, when you buy the Mandalorian, you get the, uh, the child buddy clip to go with him. So, and the buddy clip does not have a scent pack because he's filled with what, Jack? Uh... Oh, goodness, our dogs are getting excited. They do that in every video, don't they? The buddy clips have little scent beads inside of them. And the scent beads have the matching scent that's the air of adventure, right? Yeah, they have little scent beans. Beads. Did I say beans? No. Beats. Scent beads is what we got in there. No, you said beads. Well, let's show, show what beads. he looks like. Hold him up next to Isn't he cute? So little and cute. Now we did have the um, the child full size buddy. Now you can tell this buddy's been loved. He's been he's been loved. He's not brand new anymore, but that's okay. That's what they're here for. So we got the full size buddy when I first started doing CNC back in August, right? September, August. But uh, but this one is more appropriately sized to Maybe. go Mando. Though it's still pretty big compared to it. Yeah, so if you buy a Mandalorian, you get the scent buddy, uh, the scent buddy clip for free. And it comes as a bundle, so you look for that bundle. It is cute in, on the uh, on the Star Wars page on our Scentsy website. But um, if you have any little Star Wars fans, this would make a great um, kindergarten graduation gift. It's just adorable, and it, mm, it smells so good. Um, but we wanted to show you our Mando and his little matching buddy clip. And then, uh, we're waiting. It'll, uh, Sunday, we should get Darth Vader and Princess Leia. They're coming in a separate shipment. FedEx says they're coming Sunday, but sometimes FedEx gets confused and it comes a day or two later. So I can't promise, but as soon as we get Fed, uh, Princess Leia and Darth Vader, we'll show them too. Sound good? Yeah. Yeah. And the rest of our shipment was some, um, uh, Fragrance flowers that I actually 
double ordered. So I had already ordered them on a separate shipment and um, I uh, made a mistake and ordered them again. So no big deal. Better to have too many than too few, right? And so, uh, scoot your feet, Jack. So what'd we get? We got aloe water and cucumber, scentsy flower. We got, I know there's a black raspberry vanilla. Whipped Vanilla Lavender. That's from our Mother's Day collection. We got Hibiscus Pineapple. If y'all have not smelled Hibiscus Pineapple, it is so yummy in the in the uh, fragrance flowers. Black Raspberry Vanilla. Here is another Hibiscus Pineapple. And the last one, Pink Cotton. So, um, just a reminder, those fragrance flowers are uh, on sale this month and next month. They're 20... Uh, is it 25% off? 20% 20, 20 off. But you can get a bundle of three of them for $36. So that's $12 a piece. And um, I just love them. I love the little fragrance flowers. So if you've never used them before, it'd be a good time to try them. Um, if you have used them before and love them, you want to stock up now. Because normally they're $16 a piece. So you can get them for um, for $12 if you get them in quantities of three. Or you can buy one by itself for $12.50. But... That's not really, we, really what we come on to talk about, was it? We just want to talk about, you've already got Mando up there with all his little friends. Yeah. We might ought to put the little Grogu up there, too. <laughs> Grogu is his name. I called him Baby Yoda for a long time, and I got corrected. And then there were two. Yeah, so we got both of them there. But anyway, that's our new buddy. You want to say anything else? Blueberry cheesecake. Go ahead. Blueberry. Jack still loves blueberry cheesecake. It's his favorite. I haven't right? smelt it in like a couple weeks. Well, I've got two bars of it in our stash if we need some. Only two? We'll not need to order some more. Oh, we I can have to do another order some more. Some more. Okay. I have to do another six bar kit or six bar bundle and we'll add some to it. Although this <sighs> one's pretty yummy. The berry bright. All right. You guys have a good night. If you need anything, let me know. I will be placing an order tomorrow. It'll be our last order of the month. And, um,. So, if you're local and you want me to put in anything, little or small, um, we'll add it to that order. And then, we'll be placing another order on Sunday. That's May 1st. Because the Whiff Box next month promises to be a very good one. It's also got a surprise Star Wars item in there. Um, Cincy Headquarters has told us that it is the Star Wars item was not originally going to be packaged with the Whiff Box for next month. So that's going to be an add-on that they've added. Um, and they told us that the Whiff Box is going to be uh, a good bit more valuable than it normally is. And um, and so for us, not to think that it's always going to be that big of a of a value. This time it's just going to be extra good. And um, and we should, we're just, it's going to be a treat for us. So we're going to get an order in on the first and order... I think I've got at least uh, three or four um, people that want whiff boxes, so we're going to put in a big whiff box order on the on April 1st. So if y'all want one of those, you let me know too. But um, I appreciate y'all supporting our channel and uh, just humoring us when we have our fun little videos. It, we've had a lot of fun with this Scentsy thing. And so um, you guys have a good night. Have a great weekend. Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye.